In this morning's Health Watch, a little boy's life-saving 911 call. Three-year-old Jaden Boley of Maple Shade, New Jersey, was with his grandmother last Friday when she passed out. Listen to what he did next. 911, where's your emergency? Hi. Hello? Hi. Hi. Mama shit. What's wrong? Mama shit. What's wrong with her? Her blood sugar. Her blood sugar? Yeah. Okay, how old are you? Three. Three? Turns out it wasn't her blood sugar, it was a stroke, but luckily because of Jade and the paramedics got there just in time and mom, mom, Patricia is in stable condition. Jaden is here this morning with his mom, Candace Robbins, <laughs> as well as our own Dr. Jennifer Ashton. Good morning to the three of Good you. Good morning. Jaden, can you give me a little high five? Because that was <laughs> awesome. So Candace, when did you teach Jaden to call 911? Four nights before it happened. Four nights. What possessed you to do that all of a sudden? He just listened to my heartbeat and I said, Jade, if you don't hear it, you know what you do. And that was that. <laughs> so what exactly did you tell him when you taught him? How I, did you teach him? I told him, I said, if you don't hear my heartbeat or if somebody falls or anything, you have to dial 911, hit the green button and just tell them you need help. He said, okay. And you taught him just that once? Yes, that once. <laughs> Could you, four days later, were you thinking, how bizarre that I decide, something inside me told me to teach him this? Uh, it's like God sent. <laughs> I know, unbelievable. Okay, so, so Grandma falls down, Jaden, and did you, what did you do? I also taught the cops. You what? I also taught the cops. Okay. Called the cops. You called the cops. How did you do that? By one. You remembered what your mommy taught you? Uh-huh. And what did you tell the lady when she answered the phone? I don't know. I think you said mom, mom's sick, right? Which was incredible, Jen, that he was able to stay so calm and composed right. and, and have that instinct to do that. Look, it's hard even for adults to maintain yeah. composure when things like this happen, but it's so important for everyone to understand that a loss of consciousness, especially when it occurs in an out-of-hospital setting, whether it's from a heart attack, a stroke, internal bleeding, it is so important to activate the 911 system as soon as possible because every second matters, and you did such a good job. You did, because if, if he wouldn't have called so quickly and they wouldn't have come so quickly, this could have had a different ending. Absolutely. So, I mean, he is literally a, a role model for everyone. Again, not just children, but adults. Yeah. So what should every child know? Well, the most important thing is that they know that it's only for emergencies and, and really when to use it if someone's unconscious, if they're choking, if they're bleeding, if they can't wake up. Because, mm -hmm. again, children don't understand what unconscious means. They need to know where they live, their address, and they, can, they need to know that they're doing the right thing by calling an adult and they need to stay calm that okay. help will be coming. Did you see mom, mom yet in the hospital? No. You no. haven't seen her? <laughs> yeah. he, he did? What did she say to him? That um, he's her angel. Aww, he <laughs> is. Remember? You are an angel. Good job, Jaden. He's a little hero. <laughs> Thanks a lot to all of you for coming in. Thank you. All right. Up next, Jay Leno. Thank you. My pleasure. <laughs>